you to I, your I to my, I to me, to me, to me, through us and through, yours and you. subject areas like mathematicians, biologists, psychologists, we also have creative people uh, and uh, we all came together to try to solve one problem and this problem might be very familiar to many of you but it's unjustly been only addressed by art 
so far. And this problem, it's sometimes referred to as a whole, uh, but we define it as this feeling of missing someone or something you don't even know they exist. The feeling of missing something which maybe does not exist. And to find this someone or something, we conducted our research on summary of love. Uh, we looked in all countries, all continents. Uh, we researched many forms of life, uh, many forms of death even. Uh, we looked at humans, we looked at animals, we looked at inanimate objects, such as stones, such as magnets. Uh, we even decided to also consider abstract units, such as facts and numbers, because you might have noticed that also facts and numbers tend to go on top of each other, or merge with each other, or summarize. There is a certain pool which we considered love. And after many decades of research, we indeed found something. We found the answer. And the answer, maybe someone already has a clue, the answer is you. You as a non-specific, no face attached, no quality, no body attached, you. You as a grammatical second person, you as a linguistic you, you as a re reason of all language, you as a movement of thought, you as a reason for any movement at all, linguistic you, semantic you, no one if in particular, anyone, people in general, you. Uh, but we decided to go one step further, because what we found is this word, you, and this being a word, uh, it's a symbol for the actual thing, right? If you all agree with me. If we found the you word, it doesn't fa uh, mean we actually found the actual you. We can't tell you where to go and find it, how to get it. So we went one step further and we developed a tool. Uh, an instrument, an instrument for actually uh, finding the you, the thing to feel, the whole. Uh, yeah, we indeed think it's very unjustly that it's only been addressed in arts because, you know, like so many wars, so many catastrophes, so many pandemics are caused just by this missing something we don't even know if it exists. Okay.